It's been a question for years, can an iPad or iPad Pro replace a laptop? It used to be a resounding no, but the more iPad features have improved, the harder that's become to answer. Here we try to answer the iPad versus laptop question as fairly as we can. Hi, this is Phil from Make Tech Easier, and this is iPad versus laptop. Can a tablet replace a PC? Apple's iPad lineup is more powerful than ever, and because of that, Apple continues to position it as a potential laptop replacement. So how do you know if an iPad is right for you as a laptop replacement? Let's find out. The iPad can replace your laptop. There is an app for that. For many computer users, their laptop or desktop is mostly a means to explore the web, use Facebook or check email. If that is your case, then the iPad can absolutely replace a laptop. With millions of apps available, the iPad has become an incredible productivity machine. Apps for nearly every bank exist, so you can easily manage your finances. All major retailers have apps available, so you can shop till you drop without ever getting off your sofa. Desktop browser. What if you want to do work? The iPad is ready for that as well. The release of the iPad OS 13 led to the release of a desktop class version of Safari. That means any website you visit has fewer compatibility issues and you'll see far fewer mobile websites. There is even a download manager for grabbing files that can go right into the Files app, which is similar to Finder or File Explorer. Office suite and accessories. The combination of Apple's iWorks suite of desktop quality applications with Microsoft Office apps makes it easy to duplicate laptop level work. You can design a PowerPoint, fill in a spreadsheet or write a paper for class all from your iPad. And with dozens of Bluetooth keyboards and cases available, it's easy to connect a keyboard to your iPad for easier typing. The release of iPad OS 13 even made it easy to connect a mouse. That alone makes it even more believable that an iPad can work as a laptop replacement. Multitasking. So what about multitasking? One of the most needed features of laptop users is the ability to have multiple applications open at once. You can have Outlook open alongside Chrome or while you're watching Netflix. While it won't function the same way on an iPad, you can absolutely achieve the same goal. Multi-window apps enable two apps to work side by side. That means you can have one side open with a browser and the other side of your screen filled with the Notes app, for example. Netflix can play in a smaller window in a screen corner too, so you don't miss any of your favourite shows. Instead of Netflix, you can have another app open, such as Photos, that will slide over from the side as needed. The iPad will not replace your laptop. Underpowered for professional apps. The iPad has a number of great photo and video editing apps and they come very close to desktop-like support. Unfortunately, they don't always come close enough and to make them work on an iPad, compromises have to be made. For millions of professionals out there, that simply won't do. No proprietary software. If your office runs on some kind of proprietary software, that too can make it an immediate no for an iPad replacing a laptop. Too many businesses are still using their own software to keep things moving. Even with the millions of apps available, one might not exist to replace that particular proprietary software. Even without proprietary software, some presentations require desktop-level office software. PowerPoint for the iPad is really great, but it's not desktop great. If you're heavily reliant on this for work, the iPad as a laptop is not for you. Not as customizable. The idea of a desktop operating system is that you can easily customize it to your liking. That's not really the case for iPad OS. While it does come with a dock that looks like Mac OS, the internal is still pretty much locked down with limited customization options. Can an iPad really replace a laptop? The answer to that question is dependent on your usage. It's not so black and white. It really depends on your needs. Can the iPad replace a laptop for most people? Sure, but in that case, so can a smartphone. For those that really only require a few critical applications and a web browser, a smartphone does an absolutely fine job. Anyone who needs professional software should look to the iPad as more of an entertainment device than a productivity machine. How about you? Have you ever used the iPad as a laptop? Let us know your experience in the comments. Okay, as always, thanks for watching. That's all for now. See you next time.